So, you know, my first memory of coffee is sitting with my grandfather, getting served coffee milk, you know, which is basically a little bit of coffee and a whole lot of milk and a whole lot of sugar. And then over time, the proportions of milk and coffee change. So that's probably my earliest memory. You know, my great-grandfather named a community just out of appreciation and respect for his friends and neighbors. He was a, a small businessman starting a business on his own. He needed a lot of support. And his community came around him and supported his business. He served that community. It was all one-on-one -on -one relationships. So community was a, a fitting name. Cap had a, a wink and a smile that said that uh, he appreciated what you're doing and he's watching the details. So when we craft a beverage, really put all of our heart into it. You have to be fully committed to the product to make it great. You know, most people haven't experienced great coffee. They've all had, you know, a good cup of coffee, but you experience a great coffee, there's a difference. You, you feel it. You feel it in, not only in, in the way it tastes or the way it was presented to you, but the whole personality as well. But what we're looking for is the top 10% of premium coffee beans in the world to go into our blends because that represents the best that the world can offer. And it takes a little bit more work, but it does make a difference. So you have to start with good green coffee that's been cared for, that's been harvested correctly. When you do all of these things, and if you do them well, you can find the best coffee beans in the world. When you find those best coffee beans, you owe it to the consumer to roast them the right way, to package them with care and deliver them fresh. That makes a great cup of coffee. The people in the business make the difference. Walking through a plant floor and visiting with, with people and understanding, you know, what's on their mind as they craft this beverage this day. You know, what are they focused on? What are their needs? Yeah, you know, that's probably my favorite part of the business. You know, taking a lot of ownership and responsibility for this great brand. It means exceeding a customer's expectation. It means delighting a customer, exceeding an employee's expectation, being a good citizen. You're doing the things that you know are right, make you feel good, and know that it took that extra effort to make it the best. You know, it's not just one family's business, it's, it's a lot of families' business here at Community Coffee. We're part of a lot of people's lives. Passionate as I am about this company, as much as I care about this company, I know that there are employees all over who care just as much as I do. That's a wonderful feeling. It's because of all of us working together that we've built this great company. And we aspire to be the best coffee company in America. And I know through these employees and through all of our efforts, we're going to do that. We're going to be the best coffee company in America.